So let's start by holding down Alt and just clicking on the line tool, which will create a basic line. We can then select that and hitting either Command or Control G will group the shape. With the group selected, let's pop up to the shelf. And again, with Alt held, let's just click the duplicator icon. We're going to change the distribution type to a circle and let's just ramp up the count so we've got lots of lines. I'm just going to drop this radius down as well a little bit. On the basic line, let's just move its pivot point a little bit so that these rotate off a certain axis. And back on the duplicator, we're just going to change the shape rotation here. Now to add a different color to each one of these lines, we can use an atom called index to color. I'm going to set this stop to white as well, just double clicking. And then if I click in here to add more stops, I can select some more colors. Obviously pick anything you like for these. I'm going to go with some, something like this. And then all we need to do is connect the index to color to the stroke color of the line. And we're done.